guys, the Super Review Show here for another trailer review. That's right, folks. This is the War for the Planet of the Apes trailer review, okay? Now, going into this trailer, let me just say something with you guys. Going into this trailer, I was like, okay, the first two were awesome. Let's see how the third one does. Because, you know, like, normally with the third one, like, you can get a hint of, like, okay, it can, it can suck. Like, I just did a Spider-Man trailer review. Spider-Man 1, incredible trailer. Spider-Man 2, a great movie. Spider-Man 2, even better. I can... Best Spider-Man movie, Spider-Man movie we've ever had was Spider-Man Two in 2004. Hands down, shut your mouths. Anyways, but this War for the Planet of the Apes, this trailer was really good. You got the grittiness, you got the darkness, you got all this stuff, right? And what you really have is a last survivor group of people. I, I didn't get the military aspect of it personally because the military is led by this one guy who's against the apes, essentially, as far as I can see. And you really get the energy out of this trailer just by saying, you know, these guys, the, and plus the opening shot, perfect. Perfect nod to the original the original movies. Perfect nod to the hardcore fans, the cult followers, if you will, of this franchise. Guys, they're for opening shot of this trailer, if none of you got it, I'm gonna tell you what it is. In the original Planet of the Apes, the very like the very first one in 1968, one of the shots in the trailer was oh, one of the shots in the movie was them the apes on horses on the beach. That kind of sh and I I'm a big fan of it. I have the all five right right behind me as as you guys know, guys. That was a great nod to say okay we're even further in the future. The military aspect and the human aspect are just not they're they're fighting back even more. They've been hiding now. They're going to fight back. Cause it's getting crazy. Now, I don't know. This, this this just gets me even more excited. I'm starting to shake. This is so good. And War for the Planet of the Apes. This I think I feel like this is the the war we're going to get. The first two, the first one was like, okay, the, the apes have escaped. Let's all just wreck wreak havoc everywhere. And then like twenty something, I think it's twenty thirty years later, it's in the future. The humans are still trying to survive. They have no power. Because all the apes took over. This one looks like all those humans are escaped or are extinct or whatever. And the military is the only one left. Of the, the sole surviving, hard pounding military people. The soldiers, if you will. And the apes have to fight them. That looks pretty badass. And I think that's Tom Hardy in the main role. Um, I could be wrong. I gotta check on that. But this. Oh my god, this looks so good. It actually, it makes me feel bad for the humans, but the apes are just going to take over. It's going to be awesome. And where are they going to go as far as the overall franchise goes? I have no idea, but this just is getting me more excited for more ape wreak havoc action. So this is going to be great. Um, I should put that on a t-shirt. Anyways, what did you guys think of the trailer? If you guys haven't seen the trailer yet, jump in the comment section below and jump in the description of this video for, all, for the trailer itself. So that will do it for me, guys. If you guys love more of the Planet Apes, subscribe to this YouTube channel. We'll keep you up to date on everything going on in the world of the pop culture, geek culture. Anything you see behind me here, we cover right here on the Super Review Show. So thank you very much for tuning in for this. And for the Super Review Show, J-Man, off to work. I'll see you guys later.